October, and that means that the natural state's largest entertainment event has arrived, the 80th Arkansas State Fair. And our Michael Esparza wasted no time finding out what's new this year, Michael. Yes, Bob, Ashley, the moment I stepped onto the fairgrounds, I closed my eyes and could envision the lights, the smells, the sounds. Really exciting. But before I get to the good stuff, this year's new state fair general manager, Doug White, tells me he's focus focused on ensuring this year will be both the most fun and safest year yet. Cars and trucks roll in and out of the fairgrounds. With the Arkansas State Fair just a week away, it's hustle and bustle for the historic event. A wonderful event. It's such an important piece of Arkansas history. This is our 80th year. Doug White, the new general manager of the Arkansas State Fair, has some new rules in place. But rest assured, this isn't his first rodeo. The Arkansas State Fairgrounds board for nine years have been active with the State Fair for over 20 years. With more than 25 years of experience, his focus is to ensure this year is both the safest and most fun yet for everyone. Uh, we've put a special emphasis this year on security. Um, we're really concentrating on that. A new manager with a new set of rules, but not afraid to get his hands a little dirty. We've got a new main gate, new perimeter fencing. During the fair, we like to say that this is the safest spot in, in the city of Little Rock. All to ensure that this anniversary, celebrating eight decades of food, fun, and family, will continue to bring smiles for years to come. You know, this is a historic anniversary for us to be at this place for 80 years, to be on these fairgrounds and to see different people come in. Grandmothers and grandfathers that were here back in the 30s and 40s will tell me, I remember when, I can't even imagine what it looked like back then, but we've got a lot of neon now. A safe zone in the heart of Little Rock with bright lights and even brighter smiles. Now, some other notable items. The fair has shifted from 11 days to 10 days. Also, the fair will still have discounted days. Doug tells me there will be new food items for health-conscious people and a new exciting show that hasn't been in Arkansas for 24 years. Now, go check that all out. We have details on our website, including the full list. Back to you both. Michael, thanks very much. House